Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rob Balasabas, and in this video, I want to show you how to set up custom RTMP, custom RTMP inside of StreamYard. All right, and so let me share my screen, and we're gonna jump right into it. All right, so uh, let me explain what custom RTMP is first. So uh, when you go to StreamYard, by the way, if you do not have a StreamYard account yet, um, then make sure that you go to the link in the description. That'll get you a free trial to StreamYard and you can start following along uh, this tutorial, all right? So um, what I'm gonna do here is actually, I'm gonna show you guys how to use cu custom RTMP inside of StreamYard. And to do that, um, I'm gonna connect a custom RTMP from my Uscreen account, all right? So if you are not familiar with Uscreen, Uscreen is a video membership platform. It is a where I work <laughs> as head of partnerships. That's my day job. And so I'm going to I'm going to connect a live stream inside of Uscreen to uh, StreamYard. All right. So um, again, also, <laughs> if uh, you're not familiar with StreamYard, StreamYard is a live streaming platform. Actually, it's more than that. It does a whole bunch of other stuff. Uh, it records uh video podcast interviews you can multi-stream you can also repurpose your content into uh clips uh you can schedule your content and your video content to publish it's, it does so many things um but today we're going to talk about this right here which is custom rtmp all right so to explain what custom rtmp is basically when you go to Streamyard, you can set up what's called destinations right you see destinations right here and um, what that means is that destinations are all of these right here, all these little logos that you see. So it it's where a destination is where you can live stream to. So that can be your Facebook page, your Facebook group, your personal Facebook profile, your LinkedIn company page, brand page, uh, your LinkedIn personal profile, YouTube channel, of course, Twitter slash X. Um, and then down here, you can also go live on uh, Instagram through StreamYard, which is really, really cool. Um, Twitch, hop in. And then what we are going to talk about today, which is custom RTMP. Basically, for everything else that is not listed here, you can use custom RTMP as long as that platform has custom RTMP capabilities, which StreamYard does stream or sorry, which you screen does. All right. And I'm going to talk about that in just a second. I'm actually going to take you behind my uh, account here inside of you screen to show you exactly how that works. All right. So um, here we are uh, again, you have your StreamYard account. What you will pub probably see is this dashboard when you log in. Um, and that's cool. That's you're at the right place. What you need then to do is go to destinations right here. You'll see that destinations. What you'll need then to do is add a destination. All right. Then from here, you're going to go to custom RTMP. Now, when I show this to you, you're going to think, wow, that was so easy. <laughs> All right. And feel free to pause, come back, rewind as you need. Um, but you're going to see this and it's going to look so easy. All right. So, uh, again, you're going to go and click on custom RTMP right here. Let's zoom out. And then you're going to see this. Now this is a bit of text, right? And three fields. And sometimes that can get a little intimidating. All right. But it's really not as intimidating or difficult or complex as you think. There's really two out of three here that you need to fill out or uh, get from you screen. Um, the first thing I want to say is that this nickname one is kind of a it's kind of a trick a trick question because <laughs> you actually can just put anything you want. I put you screen live stream right here. okay And then there's two that leaves two. So now you've got an RTMP server URL. let me uh, let me line that up. RTMP server URL and stream key now let's let me take you over to you screen okay this is my you screen account i'm setting up what's called the live stream here it's literally called live streaming and i have a new live stream right here okay i'm not going to fill everything out all i want to do is show you guys the where you get the rtmp url and key which is right here okay right here this information right here okay so i'm going to zoom in so there it is stream url Okay, you, what you see here, stream URL, stream key, 
hosts here on uh, StreamYard, it's called RTMP server URL and stream key, right? So be really straightforward. What you essentially do is just copy these over. So you're going to copy from, I'm on StreamYard, whatever platform you're on, right? Whatever platform that you want to stream into, you will that has RTMP, you'll be able to get these two links, okay? So copy the stream URL, copy URL, put that into StreamYard right here, okay? Paste, go back to Uscreen or whatever platform you're gonna be streaming into with the RTMP, copy the stream key, copied, put that into the stream key, done. I nicknamed this, right? I got a nickname, Uscreen Livestream, okay? And then, Click that blue button, add RTMP server. Um, there is a uh, there's an additional option here. Don't get thrown off by this. It, this says here, I have a server password. This is pretty uncommon. Some some platforms will have it. This particular one does not. For Uscreen, you don't need a password. Um, so you're okay, right? You don't need to have a password here. Um, but some platforms will have a password for additional security, but you don't need that for this particular example. If you do, you just click the checkbox and you get an RTMP username and password, okay? Again, we don't need that, so we're just gonna uncheck. And then now we're gonna click on add RTMP server. And now on when you go to home, right? I'm home here. You're gonna scroll down and we're gonna go to destinations, right? We're gonna go to destinations right here. And you're gonna see that now I have these destinations, LinkedIn profile, YouTube, Instagram, and the Uscreen live stream custom RTMP. Okay, now we are all set. So now I can live stream to this, uh, to this custom RTMP, right? So if I go to home and I set up a live stream, you can see here that in this option here, I have Uscreen live stream as an option and I can just title that and create the live stream. Okay, so there you have it. If you have any questions around custom RTMP and StreamYard and even custom RTMP or live streaming slash with StreamYard and Uscreen, for example, specifically, uh, let me know in the comments. Love to help you uh, again, hopefully, you feel now that it's not as complex uh, as you may have felt before watching this video. Um, I also have a bunch of other videos here around you, uh, StreamYard, so make sure you go check that out if there's any other questions there. But again, if you can't find the answers, leave a comment um, and uh, I'd love to answer and help you in future videos. All right, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.